Welcome back. I'm Shaq. We got ourselves another video. I'm starting to see spaceships on bank. Hey, I'm in the zone. Scotty's calling me. I'm sorry. I just randomly wanted to sing that song. Don't judge me. Corey Holcomb calls out Tasha K for her lies about his wife, ex-wife. Stuff like that to his rectum. I ain't gonna lie to Tasha K, you probably messed up. You're probably getting sued again. Let's just be honest. I'm gonna make sure y'all see both videos, Tasha and Corey. But she probably getting sued again, let's be honest. But hold up, if you just clicking this video, I need y'all to hit the like button, hit the subscribe, and hit the notification bell. And in the comment section, give me a thumbs up or a heart, just to let me know that it's real. But let's roll the clips. Oh, oh you know what that was? Oh, that doo doo, man. And that was due to some of the questions I was asking. But Corey Holcomb likes his ass play with, according to his wife, his ex, is soon to be ex-wife. And that's the reason why they not together now is because she would refuse to lick his ass or put her fingers in his ass. I wouldn't do it to Corey Holcomb. All them keloids he got growing on his head, his mother penal shaft and shit. But get that white bitch Rita G to lick your ass. That's his wow. bombing. This Go is ahead. giving me like Cat Williams <laughs> vibes <laughs> on, that on this club Shay Shay. <laughs> mm, those some strong accusations, my sister. Strong accusations. But you already know I'm going to play the Corey Holcomb video. Let's see what Corey Holcomb had to say about this situation. Oh, girl. The ugly bitch. Heat of the night face <laughs> the heat. I'm gonna tell you something, bitch. You fucked up. You fucked up. You played with a real nigga ass on them cake ass nigga shows. <laughs> you went on Pierre and the other comedy hype nigga show because I know they'll have you as guests. And you motherfucking talked about what with my ass? Because you know you're gonna have to prove that. See, I take this. I take that. You can't fuck with niggas. You can't fuck with a real nigga masculinity. I know you was lying. And you're gonna have to prove that you wasn't. You're gonna have to prove you weren't lying. Bitch. Let me tell you something. Miss Holcomb, me, we in court. We splitting up. That don't mean you get to motherfucking run with bullshit. Miss Holcomb, if Miss Holcomb said Corey like a motherfucker playing in his ass, you're going to have to prove that. You know the paperwork coming. I know where to find you. You on your little chilling circuit run. You know what I'm saying? I'm a videotape you getting served. You can't lie on the, why you got all these sexual lies on people? You said the one girl had herpes, she got four million rewarded to her. We know that you ain't got it and you ain't gonna never have it because in this country you can't collect like you want to. That's why she get ties to your YouTube. You demonetized already. You probably finna lose the channel because you're gonna have to prove what you said about my motherfucking ass. Just let me know. You don't know nothing about Corey Oakham. We joked about it like that before on my show. I said it was a trying to go in my ass and I went over there with a shitty booty. Because <laughs> I'm like, oh, this an ass grabbing. Right. So I went over there with a shitty booty and the bitch motherfucking had the room stinking. That's when I knew I had to work on my diet. Oh, my God. <laughs> you don't understand the type of nigga you fucking with. But you brought my wife name up. You said his soon-to-be ex-wife said that he like motherfuckers playing in his ass. You gonna have to prove that now, Pierre was all talking about ass. Uh oh. When she was talking about ass, Pierre was like, What's wrong with digging in the ass? I like digging in the ass. Uh -huh. I ain't knocking the nigga, but I already knew that. I ain't mad at I ain't mad at Pierre or the comedy hype nigga for having you on. But you went on there and you lied on me. Big screen. Whoa. That was gross. That was that is the most nastiest thing I just had to encounter. Corey Holcomb is by far the most devilish person I've ever met. For you to see you over there with a dirty booty, that's the most disgusting thing I've ever heard just to ruin a lady's life. Ah. 
but I support it. Hey, perhaps I could be of some assistance. But Tasha K, you fucked up. You fucked up. I didn't know her channel was demonetized. Kind of made me uncomfortable. Might have to clean up my videos. Might have to go and delete some of my videos. Delete, 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 delete. Everybody's already said it before. Tasha K just talks. And the easiest thing, the easiest thing for her to do is just say allegedly. All she got to do is say allegedly. That's it? That's it. How do you have this many rants? The one word that will stop you from being sued by everybody you won't use. She can easily do it. She can literally be listening to a person while they're telling a bunch of lies or whatever they want to tell. All she got to do is really? Wow. Allegedly. Wow. She don't have to do nothing else. If you get sued again, Tosh K, I ain't gonna lie to you. You gonna, you gonna have to like run from the country. Like what he said is true. I have been noticing. Tasha K has been doing a lot of, a lot of interviews. You have been doing a lot of them. You ain't do, you ain't do this many before. I don't even know if you did any. Probably did like one, maybe two. Try eight. Eight? Heard enough. And besides, I don't even trust that Pierre guy. This is that one comedian, D-Lay, I think that's his name. When he brought up dudes with wigs and Pierre just switched his whole shit up real fast. I'm like, mm. <laughs> He made a joke about dudes with wigs and this guy immediately try to bring up something he said he wasn't gonna talk about. Just go look it up. Comedian Pierre Beef Delay. Something like that. I don't know, just go, just go look it up. I should put it in the video. I'm, I'm kind of lazy, I apologize. I don't wanna do it. But with Natasha K, you better pray you got proof. Or it's over, it's gone. I hope you liked this video. If you haven't already, hit the like button and subscribe. And if you want to watch more videos like this, you should go watch my shorts or hit the notification bell so you'll know another video coming out.